Hey everybody, Spiral Sigil here. Welcome back to some more Shovel Knight. All right, let's take on this last of the four mercenaries. So if you're playing this for the first time, this will be your last achievement that you need to get. Oh yeah, this guy here. I, I could, I was like, what does this guy even do? What magic is this? Power, honor, the traits of a respectable knight. Sir, I don't believe we've met. We meet today on the field of battle. We've both defeated many knights and traveled far. Today, we fight. Stand aside, you and I have no reason to battle. Conflict is a reason unto itself, brave knight. Today, you will be tested. Are you ready? Come at me, bro! I like how you've got this big-ass spiky helmet. Doesn't protect you from the downstab. He just became thunder! Wow, he's, he's actually doing a shitload of damage to me. I may actually have to start uh, using one of these. Yeah, there we go. The very, I didn't get hit again. The very first time I had to use an uh, i in this entire game was against a mercenary. Not one of the guys I'm actually supposed to be fighting, but one of the guys who just picked a fight with me just cuz. Ah, I've been bested, but barely. You still need training to overcome what lies ahead. Farewell, Shovel Knight. Thank you. I mean, granted, if I was fighting more intelligently, I wouldn't even have to do that much, but still. Anyway, that, like I said, that unto itself is an achievement if you don't already have all four of them beaten and the achievement for it. Uh, I was considering going back to getting an I another I core, but you know what? I'll end up with one anyway. So the last two knights are Tinker Knight or Propeller Knight. Both of them have sages that drive me batshit insane, but this is the worst offender, so I guess I'll get this out of the way now. Although I fully expect just to get pissed at some point and have to take a long-ass hiatus from this Let's Play, just because of this stage again. This was the most annoying stage, in my opinion. And you know what, honestly, I don't even sure why I hated it so much. You fuck. There we go. Which is weird, you'd think I'd actually like this stage, because it has a lot of, uh... A lot of parts that are very Metal Man-ish from Mega Man 2, and Metal Man was my favorite Robot Master. There should be a little reason I, I dislike this stage. Ah, I always get that fucking rat is in there, too. Oh, right, the Gear Magician. Nothing above, bitch. Yeah, th there's a lot about this that reminds me of uh, Metal Man stage. Like the, the spinning uh, gears and the, the, the treadmills you have to run on. Lots of it. Oh, there he is. That didn't take long. And again. Uh, absorb all the treasure near me. Alright, so it's not the healing one, but you know what? I'll take it. Wait, what am I doing? Let's do that. The ladder up here. Make sure you grab it because you want that over there. Then ride the gear across. And it's a gem. Okay. I wasn't sure if this was a gem or a song. I know I found it last time, so I couldn't remember if it was something I needed to bother with or not. Moving on. So like, yeah, there should be a checkpoint coming up here soon. Alright, fine. There. There, I used the stupid blast horn, you happy game? That's that's what I'll use it for. Killing these stupid rabbit things that I hate with every fiber of my being. That, I guess that's a good enough use for them. I mean, God forbid, I... Oh, I can't, I can't even use the stupid things on a ladder. I don't know why I thought I could, but I'm actually surprised I can't. Nope. Yeah, actually, have I even tried to use items on a ladder before this? 
Either way, I think one of the rooms that always ticks me off is coming up, because I seem to remember being stuck at that particular checkpoint for a really long time. Right, I can go to the right from here. I'm trying to wait until he shoots off his little gear thingy. Damn it. That didn't work. Damn it! Fuck you, treadmills. Oh my god, this is getting embarrassing now. Get up the ladder, get across the fucking treadmill, jump over the gear. There you go, there's a trooper for you. Get all the- alright, fine. I'll go, I'll go well one more time, just to get the fucking treasure that fell. Make it across, go in the room. There you go. Look at that, look who's winning at life right now. Nope. Ignored! Don't even care. Fuck you, rabbit-looking thing. Yep, yeah, it's this room here. No, no, no. Bad. Ah, damn it! I thought you were a rat! Now, you can jump across on the bottom floor there. But this also just works as well. Going up. No, no, go away. Okay. Now you need to do this to get the dungeon item for this stage. Which is over here. A weird mechanic item that I didn't actually use all that much after I got it. That is the weird part. Like, I, I used this, I think, for this stage and one other one, and that was about it. In the village or out in the field, I have all the deals. You're not gonna believe what I just found. The mobile gear. Basically, it works like a rail cart. So, you pop it back, you jump on it, and you ride across. You'll do little hops to get you further across stages that you otherwise wouldn't be able to go. That's more or less the gist of it. So, to get back across, it'll do the little hops off the spikes for you, so you don't have to. And then you just pump the ladder and you're gone. Easy peasy. Come on. There you go. Actually, yeah, I'm almost done. I've got one item left to get. Wow. I guess I'm only su This room. Oh, I hate this room. I guess I'm only really surprised by how many items I have left to pick up, simply because of the last time where I was... Come on. Okay, good. I was, uh, I, I was missing the uh, last chalice for a good while. Ignoring, ignoring, not getting killed by a missile again. Forget it. Alright, before I go forward, I want to go up. These little turbine things here, if you jump consecutively on them, you'll be able to get across them. I think I want to use this here, don't I? Oh, I don't remember if I want to do this or not. I can't remember if I'm supposed to ride this across or not. Oh, no, I wouldn't have made that. There we go. And just to be safe, because I don't trust these spikes, I'll go down this way. Alright. I know I'm being overly paranoid when it comes to spikes, but I'm breaking every single checkpoint. It's in my- Ah! <laughs> Sorry, I forgot about it. Did I forgot it did that? I'm being overly cautious because I'm breaking every single checkpoint. It's in my best interest to be overly cautious than underly cautious. Uh, I can't recall if I want to jump yet. Yes, I do. Die! That fucking knight has a downstab? Fuck you! That's my move! Trademark Shovel Knight, whenever the hell this game came out. Alright, there should be some health somewhere in this room, or the next room. And I'm, I'm glad that my jump button decided to glitch out there.
I also like how flicking the gear only sends it over my head. There we go. Alright, I totally want that pink gem that's down there. So, we'll get that. Okay, why did you do that? Alright, and I can fish here because I'm actually not at risk of missiles coming out of nowhere to hit me. So, like, I know I skipped that last fishing spot at what could have been a really easy spot to get the extra bit of cash. But with those missiles flying around, and I've been knocked into that room, like, that room that I passed with all the missiles flying around and the mobile platforms that I had to get across was the reason I kept rage quitting the stage so bloody hard the first time I did this. Right. These guys are just going to be a, a fucking annoyance. Wait, can I get... Is there anything... There is something I could break over here. It wasn't anything important. This is the easiest way to get them, is just phase, phase through them, and then attack after. Done. And this puts you, that ladder right there is where you would have otherwise come out if you had gone down, if you'd gone from the other way instead of going after that one pink gem that I went after. Ah, crap, it's one of the auto scroll stages. Real easy to die in parts like this. Especially when I can't see what I'm fucking doing. This way? I don't remember. Okay, I do. I couldn't remember which way I had to go. Actually, I think I'm at the boss now. Wee! Sorry, that's fun. What? Well, it is fun when it's fun, isn't it? Am I at the boss already? Oh my god, that was so much easier than I remembered it being. I thought I was gonna get pissed. Ah! Did you have to make all that noise? I can't think straight! It's so much work to do! Just, just just, work on letting me pass, little friend. Oh, big words, Tin Man! You're more a Tin Man than I am. Look at you, look at me. I'll show you a thing or two. Alright, now, this guy is actually misleading. He's got two forms. One is this first one with the cutesy little music, where he throws wrenches at you, and runs back and forth. But the entire point of this form is just to not take stupid damage. Because you do have to go through a second form, and it, that form has just as much health as every other boss in this game. Full bar. Thank you, if you only take one or two hits here, you're still fine, but if you've got any of the I cores as well, that'll also help you. I, I'm fighting really piss poor right now, that's because I know how to fight the second form. There. Like, the first time I played this, I'm like, even even though it was my first time to the game, I'm like, there's more to this fight. There obviously has to be more to this fight. And sure enough, there is. Now, this thing looks really imposing, but it's not. You ride these missiles up, get on top of the drill. Try not to bounce through his head like that. Try not to take any stupid damage for doing this either. Was really trying to avoid doing that. That. There we go. No, I didn't want to fall through that again. God damn it. There. I swear to God, the thing is perfectly designed to make you fucking fall through it. Which makes sense, because it is a boss fight, you're not supposed to have an easy time of it. But still, it's really annoying. Oh. Alright, fuck it. We're going for this. You wanna play? We'll play. There. I'm not getting killed by your stupid ass, because I wanna fight like a cheap fuck. 
I'm sure that made absolutely no sense, but I'm gonna stick with that. Do I get a dream? Come on, dream? Or is it gonna be the last boss? Because I got one more Order Knight to fight, and if that's gonna be where the dream is, I can understand you're coming from there, too. Nope, no dream. Okay, it's gotta be the last one, because I'm pretty sure there's one dream left. Let me hop up. Alright, sweet. Pretty handy, pretty handy. We got one boss left to go, but before we do that, and before we sign off, I'm also gonna run back here and grab one more i because I don't have any control for which ones I get, and then there's a- I want to get the healing one. Aid me! Uh, refills all health and magic, yes. Perfect. Alright, now I'm gonna be going back and heading into the next level, so that'll be in the next episode of Shovel Knight, the Let's Play. In the meantime, leave me a comment, a like, a subscribe, a rate, anything you want, and I will address it as soon as I can. In the meantime, Spiral Sigil, out.